we should be looking at India and uh, take a few uh, lessons from what's happening in India. <laughs> Nothing's happened in French cinema um, so far. I mean, we've had rumors and allegations. We've had um, actresses coming forward and others uh, defending uh, How do you explain uh, that? Molesters. So uh, there's, there's uh, obviously a very big problem with sexual harassment in this country, and we uh, we do well not to uh, give lessons to the rest of the world. Why, about why that. are the but French the behind thing, the Indians then? Well, I, I, it's it's not a competition, uh, mm. but I, I what is really important. Um, because since we're talking about India, is to remember that the history of feminism in India is a very long history. Mm. This doesn't come out out of nothing. Um, this, the feminist movement in India has a very long history, uh, uh, one that actually predates um, the feminist movements in France. Um, and what we are witnessing today is a new wave of feminism, which is, you know, a source of great hope. Um, young women and less young women in India are now looking at what's happening in the rest of the world, using new tools, technological tools, and traditional means of um, contest and dissent to, to protest. And this is, this is very refreshing. This is very new. This is a global phenomenon. And France is a big behind, I feel. I think we, sh we, we should, you know, we, we'd be better off if we got some inspiration from India or uh, the U.S.